Alright, so I scheduled a visit with my son this evening at 10 p.m. It is 10 01 and just waiting, seeing what's you know going on and happening. I can see what's flashing. Mm -hmm. You see that? Now you can't really uh -huh. see what's flashing. So we're gonna wait. Sunday at it is 10.02 p.m. Sunday so the visit the visitation is right here because these are the games that they play alright the games they play they already cutting into my time because they late I'm gonna see him. It is 10 02. Clock on the wall. Uh, you can tell it. Alright. Mm hmm. And the gauge that they play is okay. Let's sit. See if I can set it up here. Alright. On uh, this back light. I'm gonna cut it off. Uh, I'm walking the house. I'm gonna cut it off. Cut this one off. Still waiting. And document. It's a reason for a sub. Which I figured. It's not gonna happen. I, we visited him on his birthday. He was assaulted on his birthday. Taken out. Hospital, ambulance, all that type of thing. Heard he's back in New County, uh, New Alabama County Jail. Uh, it is okay. Uh, I got the proof of... I scheduled a visit. They denied it. All right? We seen him Wednesday. Everything was cool. I scheduled a visit. Video visit for him Friday. To tell them about the injustices that is going on with him being in there a day and a half later. They denied the video call because it's going to come out. The truth is going to come out. So I scheduled a video appointment this evening. Look, they accepted it and all. This is video proof, but it is okay. It is okay. So what we gonna do? I'm gonna sit here the whole 20 minutes cause like I figured it like I thought. More than likely, there, uh, it's a great possibility that they will not let him do the video visit because what he's in the infirmary okay I was instructed to do certain things that is fine we're gonna you know do what we do right now we're gonna blog it and everything and then uh, let them see, uh, well, let me choose my words carefully. Uh, uh, there is uh, the problem of him having law, legal law access. Supreme Court rules, Supreme Court rules. So what we gonna do is sit here a little bit. Uh, what we gonna do is sit here. Hey, let me get this book, this right here. So, what they say something to me? What they say something to me? What I'm gonna say is, uh, 
what I'm gonna say is, uh, huh. State versus Miller, June the 9th, 2017, by SC State Supreme Court. Ignorance of the law is just not. Ignorance of the law skews no one. That's gonna be first of all. Then I'm gonna say the butt starts here, Mr. Lee, which is butts versus Econo, 438, US 478, 506, 1978, United States versus Lee. 106 U.S. at 220, 1982, constitutional law. A governing principle of a constitutional democracy is that all officers of the government, from the highest to the lowest, are bound to obey. No one obey it. Uh, obey it. No one is. No one in this country is so high that. He is above the law. No officer or the law may set that law at defiance with impunity. So we're going to do that. We're going to do that. Right? Then after that, we're going to look at Michael Taylor versus Robert Royce, California State Law, Court of Appeals, decided November 2nd, 2020, there is no qualified immunity. Even judges could be sued now. So with me saying all this, I have a right to be vexatious and belligerent. Okay? We, you know, I ain't gonna... It's okay. This is being filmed and documented. So what we gonna do? Okay. So I already do. This is what they're not gonna do. Because, okay. It's all good. So. I'm not going to hang up um, on the call. I'm going to let it play all the way out. I'm going to let it play all the way out. Then, I'm going to take this right here. Save it. All right. That's what we're going to do. Yeah. Yeah. Such as this being monitored and recorded. Uh-huh. I paid for a video visit. It's on. Where is my son? Is he still in the infirmary? Uh-huh. When did he get back from the hospital? Uh-huh. We ain't gonna say too much. Incident happened right at we me and his mother visited him on his birthday later on that night. Somehow, you know what? With that incident, that whatever. Okay, I called his attorney. Seems like something happened Wednesday. Been calling since Friday. Can't get to his attorney to find out. I'm glad this session is being monitored and recorded. It's being monitored and recorded on y'all end and also different ways on this end. Okay. I'm just the forefront. I'm just the forefront of what's going on with my son. Okay. It's the backing. So that's what y'all gonna do. Take the ten dollars, right? And that's fine. Because 
I'm going to give this a curious. I'm going to get my money back. And I'm going to schedule another visit again. And I know y'all hear me. You see me and you hear me. It's all good. You did wrong with ill intent. The judicial system is set in place for a reason. Every time I, you know, try to comply with the judicial system, like the incident with the Ramada that was on the news, try to help police and sheriffs. You know, our car got, um, we left our vehicle to be, you know, ran through through the police inspected. Later on after that, it gets towed to a a, 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 a tow lot. And all my heat in there tools was stole out of. Okay? Helping, working with the police. Situation with my son. Found him, got him, talked to him. We turned them in. Helping the police again. And look at what they do. Look at what they do. Okay. Very vindictive. The law is set in place for a reason. I am not a type of person that's going to say free anybody. Let the law handle it. But look how the law handle it. That's how you want to do it? Fine, so be it. Gonna be the proof. Ten fourteen, six minutes left. Okay, cool. Ten sixteen. All right. So what I'm gonna do? Let's come in here. No, I ain't gonna do all that right now. Oh, I'll get it ready. I will get it ready. Like right here on my phone. Right. If you're looking at my phone, like right here, you can't see it right here. So I know they're looking and recording because when you see the your phone, it's flashing. It's flashing. Or watching. 
15 minutes in. I will not click off so they can say I hung up on the call. Mm hmm. They're yeah, like, when we turn them in, they come around, check our house, like, if you're wrong, you're wrong. Like, yeah, like, I'm going to hobble or feed you, I don't care if it's my son or not. We ain't have bugs in the house. Got them now? So I'm going to let them do what they do. They can watch us all day long. I invite them here. Before the incident happened, I mean, after the incident happened, I invited them here. I tried to get him. That's what I said. I, well, I didn't invite them. They're before there. Yeah, I caught. Oh, that's going to come out because they're trying to erase all that. It's all good. It's all good. But. Legally, in the state of North Carolina, you can, re you can record things plus phone conversations. If I'm in North Carolina, they in North Carolina, I record the conversation because I can sit to myself to record it. When they say, we do not allow you to record the conversation, it don't matter. But it's okay. It's okay. And I'm going to sit back and let the other ones, everybody else, do this here. I'm going to sit back. 8, 7, 53. Oh, what time is it? 10, 19. I'm going to sit here the whole time. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Then I'm gonna sit. Yeah, it's a 20 minute call that I paid for that they didn't, you know, do. So they watching me trying to get an indication and listen to me of what's going on. Well, they will probably find out a whole lot tomorrow. <laughs> they gonna find out a whole lot tomorrow. Uh huh. The video call has in it. Uh huh. Nah. Did I see him? No. Uh 